Hello everybody, it's Linda and I just wanted to show you all the different pendants that I've made out of polymer clay and beads and stuff for the past two days. So this is um, what I came up with. I made uh, this little heart here, it says beauty. Got another one here, it says heart. And here's another one, some beads, or a lot of beads. <laughs> and a more steampunk one, this one, here. And, uh, This little house here it says flight. <laughs> Maybe I want to run away from home. <laughs> no, but I just like the print. There's the peacock feather here, and yeah. Another heart. I love these hearts. They're so fun to make. It says friend. Here's a heart that says imagine. Here's one. It says friend. Or friends, actually. Here's one with a little moon face. And this one is, I think, one of my favorites. It's a bit dark, but I really like the design. It's very easy or simple <laughs> and easy. <laughs> um, to get everything tangled up of course and here is another one it says friends yeah that's the stupid one and here is one other one with a butterfly from the butterfly stamp set that i got from anna thank you anna and it says flight here yeah, and that's that and then the last little house here it says play so <laughs> okay so thank you for watching and for those of you who don't want to know how i did this thanks a lot for watching and have a wonderful day and for the rest of you see you again really soon today i'm working with polymer clay so i thought i'd just do some filming and show you uh, a little bit of the process behind uh, what i create so i'll film as i go along so I just start by conditioning a piece of clay by rolling it between my hands. Some people have uh, like a pasta machine that they use to condition their clay and that's fine but I don't have any so I'm using my hands. I'm going to start by just shaping one half of the heart that I want to make like so and then the other half which will be a little bit bigger you have to excuse my hands and nails they will look horrible because of the clay and paint and everything that I've been working with these past few days but let's see so now I got a heart and I'll start building from there for a girl so I'll be using some girly bits and pieces I've got some parts of um, a bracelet but it works and I want to cut off these pieces on the ends here it doesn't matter that the ends here are just not straight or anything because they will be covered by clay anyway so I'm just going to push that into here like so
it's actually it's actually a brad but it works fine to make the imprint so i just push it in and now i have this screw imprint here so playing with the clay i got an idea i have this eye pin pretty long so i'm just uh, putting some beads and spacer beads on it and i'll embed this into the heart here I like using the words that are in these Inka Dinka Do in chi stamps because they are really small. Sorry about the glare. And uh, perfect size. 